we're talking about how to attract the love and keep the love of a healthy masculine guy who you would love to be in a relationship with. Healthy guys, the sort of guys that you ladies say all the time to us that you want, want a healthy woman as well. They want a woman who makes them feel needed, but isn't needy. Because like everybody, you, me, your friends, everybody out there in the world wants to feel needed. They want to feel like they are a part of something and the other person wants and desires them in their life. It's not about you actually needing him. It's about you wanting him. It's about you showing that you actually want him and that he has a space in your life for him where he is of value to you. So just have a bit of a think about that. You know, next time you're in a situation where you're like, yeah, but I don't need him to do that. I don't need him that, you know, I can provide for myself. I provide for my family. You know, I just want to have fun together, but you know, hey, hey, don't try and do too much for me. So if that has ever happened for you, just, it's cool, right? There's no judgment here. You need to be independent. So still have your own life, still have your own interests, still have your own stuff going on. Because when you have your own stuff going on, and they have their stuff going on, and then you come together, you have all these different experiences to share. It helps to keep the spark there, the interest there, the engagement there. Plus healthy, like strong masculine guys are looking for a lady who has got a life, that they're not reliant upon them. When you are independent and then decide to be interdependent, not dependent on each other, but interdependent, where you choose to be together, you choose to make space for each other, you choose to create an amazing life together, that's very different from being dependent on each other. And it's also, you've got to be conscious of not being too independent from each other. So it's about coming up with a, a balance that works for you, works in your relationships, where you have your life, they have their life, but you choose to come together to show each other love, respect, care, and attention, and to actively engage with each other so that you keep that communication and that spark going, that interest level going. Another thing is we so often miss this, ladies. We forget to actually compliment each other. Has that ever happened in your relationships? You know, maybe maybe the guy didn't compliment you, didn't show you appreciation for what you do for him, didn't tell you how beautiful you are, you know, how gorgeous you're looking in that dress tonight, you know, how much he appreciates the things that you do for him. And at the same time, sometimes we get so caught up in our own stuff, in what we're not getting, that sometimes we forget to actually compliment the other person, put some effort and time and energy into making the other person feel good. Have you ever had that happen to you? Has someone like just in your relationships just not compliments you ever? Or maybe, you know, you can put your hand up and own it and just say, look, you're right. I was so busy doing my thing that I forgot to actually compliment the other person and help them to feel good and let them know how much I actually admired them, how much I respected them, how much I appreciated the effort that they put into our relationship. Because one thing that holds true in every situation, ladies, is that if you're looking for something from the relationship, the other person is most likely looking for the exact same thing. Because what often happens is when we don't feel like we're getting respect, we don't give respect. When we don't feel like we're receiving admiration, we don't give admiration. When we don't feel appreciated, we don't show appreciation. That's a really important thing in any relationship. And just stop and ask yourself that. In your past relationships, were you always appreciative and showed him actively went out of your way to say or do things that showed him how much you appreciated him.